Um, tell me about the song Gillette. You know, yeah. I, I just saw the video, mm-hmm. a lot of energy. Mm-hmm. Tell me about kind of like how that song came about, yeah. you know, what inspired you to do that song and how it became, you know, one of your singles that kind of kind of took off a little bit. So I recorded that at an Airbnb in Arizona. We were actually shooting the Max video shoot. Like it was that time. And, you know, just so much momentum and so much energy was there at that shoot that I feel like it all went into Gillette as well because we recorded in the kitchen. Bray cooked up, cooked up this fire beat, which you heard on Gillette. And then um, we basically, I had an idea of being in a magazine. And also we wanted, you know, with that NFL, the NFL place in which it did get, we springboarded from the, that idea and it made the video. And, you know, we had, um, we had skateboarding in it. We had, we had a, the group of entourage. We really wanted that urban feel, you know, in the city and just whatnot. So kind of like, I like when artists go out there, you know, mm-hmm. comfort zone and record, you know, mm-hmm. you being from Georgia and you say recorded that joint in Arizona. Have you recorded anywhere else besides? Besides Georgia um, and Arizona? Yeah, I've recorded in LA. I've recorded in Toronto, most recently Toronto. Um, I just had a studio session there, came back from there from a show. I've recorded New York. Uh, yeah, I think that's. You know, not to alienate any of your fans in yeah. any of those cities. What was your favorite recording? Was it LA? Was it Canada? Was it New York? Where did you really get so, the vibe? I think, I think like last year might have been, you know, like in LA, for the first, I caught like such a recording groove. And yeah, you know, I ended up recording a ton of songs during that time that will be on my album. So, yeah. Okay. And speaking of your album, what's the, what's the, you have a, you have a title of mm-hmm. your album? You're still working yeah. on that right now. It's called New Genesis. New Genesis. Like, yeah. what's, the, what's the meaning behind that? Uh, so it was during a time where my life was really changed. Changing, and I was going through a array of an emotions, going heartbreak, as well as just my life changing because I was moving to LA um, around that point. So with my life changing and everything, it was—it's a real time capsule of an album. To, you know, for you're gonna really hear everything that I was going through and what was going on in my head during these times. And when we expecting that? What can we expect that to drop? Probably late February or March. Mm-hmm.